It's Taco Tuesday! Tacos, bro. You ready to eat some tacos, bro? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy, Law Cannon, and today is Taco Tuesday. So you know what that means. We are doing some flank steak Mexican tacos. Let's get into it. So to start this dish off, first off, you're going to start with your flank steak. And if you cannot find some flank steak in your local store, then you can use some skirt steak. But flank steak or skirt steak are perfect for Mexican tacos. Now take your steak and dice these up into some really small strips or some nice cubes. And we're going to start the seasoning off with two teaspoons of minced garlic. Then you're going to want to add two teaspoons of cumin. Now let's do three. Let's do three. Add about a teaspoon of onion powder. Add in about a teaspoon of oregano. Add some chili powder. Um, I prefer to just sprinkle this on, not really a teaspoon, because it's like kind of to my liking. Add about a teaspoon of black pepper. Add five teaspoons of soy sauce. Add about two teaspoons of olive oil. Add one teaspoon of vinegar. Now add about a third cup of freshly squeezed orange juice. And lastly, add fresh juice of one lime. Now that you've created your steak marinade, mix all of these ingredients up with your steak. Make sure every piece of the steak is 150% marinated. Now, once you see that your steak is 100% marinated, you want to want to leave this in this bowl covered with aluminum foil for about, I say, two to four hours if you just want a really good marinade. I mean, you can't cook this immediately, but for that best flavor, I say two to four hours. Take one raw onion, dice it finely, and just set that aside because what's a good Mexican taco without onions and cilantro? So now that you can take your steak out of the fridge, it's been marinating for about two to four hours. Take some olive oil, pour that in your skillet, and we can start cooking this steak meat. I am cooking this steak on medium high. I say closer towards the high side versus medium, but yes, medium high. And I am just cooking it until it gets to about medium well, because that's how I prefer my steak tacos. I eat a steak medium, but for steak tacos, I'm gonna go with medium well. Whew, man, these tacos smelling amazing. So what I like to usually do, I'm gonna give y'all one last tip. I like to pop my steak in a broiler really quickly just so I can get that nice brown sear on the top. Now I only broil these for about two to three minutes. Um, 
I don't know how your strong your oven is or how weak your oven is. I just say continuously watch in the broiler because you don't want to make these into dog food burnt bites tacos. <laughs> but yeah, you're pretty much done now. So get you your corn tortillas. You can get your onion, get your cilantro that you set aside and get some nice Mexican cheese. Pour that on top and boom, you now have some Mexican authentic tacos. Oh yeah, you cannot forget your salsa verde. Um, in my next video, I will be dropping soon. Um, I will be showing you guys how to make this from scratch as well, or you could just buy it from the store. I prefer mine from scratch. But yeah, thank you guys so much. Please subscribe, like this video, comment below. Please guys, comment below. Share this video and just stay tuned for the next ones. Thank you guys so much for watching. We out of here. It's Tuesday trick, more margaritas. I'm with Katrina, she loves Selena. She likes it hard.